Itzrak Kaplan, a bus driver in Jerusalem, flew to New York from Israel in mid-March with plans to crash a wedding on Skillman Street in Williamsburg. The media wasn't exactly welcome. You come as press? Yeah. So show me a badge. Kaplan said he was looking for his 17-year-old daughter, who left Israel to follow charismatic Brooklyn rabbi Yoel Roth, a fixture on YouTube and Twitter. Kaplan said the teen was already engaged to a Roth follower. He sent mail to my daughter, it been 16. Kaplan was hoping he'd find his daughter entering a reception for a bride who was alleged to be 15 with a groom who was 21. The NYPD and Administration for Children's Services launched an investigation. Roth's followers weren't talking. I'm with PIX11, Mary Murphy. I don't want to talk to but you. But there were some concerns that the bride was underage, that she was young. I didn't see your birth certificate. Moshe Kaplan, Israq's son, said two of his sisters were already married to Roth followers at ages 16 and 19. We have two sisters here, and now this is the trip. This is the third sister? Yes, we have two sisters in this court. Why do you call it a cult? Because all the decisions from all the people in this community here, he make all the decisions. At one point, a Roth supporter confronted the Kaplans. You have no idea what's going on. Whatever you we said, know. you have no idea. Okay. Just, going just on? What is going on? I made it from people. Okay. No, no. No. Are you recruiting no. young girls to come no. over no. here no. under? No. I, I didn't hear your question, but the, the answer to your question is that if you take anything, any information for anybody in the street that have no idea what's going on, no. you can just post it wherever you want. Here. Under current New York state law, any young person who wants to get married between the ages of 17 and 18 needs parental and judicial permission to do so. But a religious ceremony is something quite different. A marriage can be conducted within the religious environment and not registered, and that would be considered a binding religious marriage. Yehudis Fletcher, a British scholar who writes about Jewish extremism, married into Brooklyn's Satmar community when she was 18, had three children, and then managed to get a divorce, which can be difficult. She has studied some of Rabbi Roth's speeches. Worrying about boys potentially spilling their seed or having sort of lustful thoughts. That's a really problematic positioning of women to be a, a vessel for men's sexuality. Hasidic sources said authorities helped the Kaplans locate the third teen daughter and they brought her home to Israel. When we tried to find Rabbi Roth at his Brooklyn base, followers took cell phone videos of our photographer and me. I work with Pix11, I was wondering, um, do you know if Rabbi Roth is around? When we called the yeshiva seeking the rabbi or his secretary, a woman who answered the phone took our number and no one called back. For now, it seems, the rabbi will let his social media do the talking. I'm Mary Murphy, PIX11 News.